Okay, TMD magnetic field. Drawing up a new plans for vault and secure the TMD. Building it will be large undertaking and difficult to keep secret. What can I who can I trust with this? Okay, they thought that if they just put enough E99 in someone, they could suck it out with TMD and it would be fine. But that's not the thing. This guy just discovered that Dr. Dimitchev has secu secretly continued with human experimentation. Even though he's been su uh, suspended. I must tell Barisov. Bing. Oh, hello. Personnel, we are missing some back issue of Propaganda Illustrated. If you remove materials from the records room, return it. When you are done, do not leave them in the restroom. <sighs> More 12 is... Oh, mere 12 is wrong. Uh, I understand that Dr. Beresov has been spending much time down there. Uh, what has he been researching? Keep an eye on him and report any suspicious behavior. More film! Oh, it's just so bad. 
So the next thing I'm gonna get gonna be ding, a teleportation device. Oh my god! I don't know where the hell those things are coming from. I guess I gotta go through that big hole that that thing punched in the wall. Shut your mouth. Wait, where am I supposed to go? supposed to go Turn alive and off. 
from Sergeant Herkoff. Colonel Ivanov, to inform you that Dr. Korkov, the head of your teleportation team, research team, was found murdered in his apartment last night. What was, what was, has me confused is how his assailant was able to enter the room. All the doors and windows were boarded up and, in, and nailed shut from the inside. We had to break the door down to get in. I will keep you informed on information we uncover. Oh, next. Hmm. This is a boss over here. Thank <laughs> you. 
Get wrecked, you ugly bastard. Captain Ranko, over here. Come in, Catherine. are gearing up. Renko, use the TMD to renew the power junctions on the fence. That should buy us some time. coming from Jesus. That was a nice bit of work down there, Renko. Thank you. Thank you very much. I know, I'm a total badass. 
my god. <laughs> hey, Hammer is playing Destiny. My god, you haven't aged a day. Remarkable. You've undoubtedly figured out the timeline has been altered. Russia rules the world, and Demichev is the chancellor. Here, let me show you what happened to the world after you saved Demichev from the burning building. Oh, okay. So that was the guy I saved in the, the beginning. The I invented the TMD, Demichev wanted it. He demanded I hand it over for him to use in his research. When I refused, he had me and everyone else who wouldn't cooperate labeled as traitors. If it weren't for you, I would have been killed along with everyone else. Demichev was obsessed with the power and possibilities of the singularity. But a few months after it came online, there was a terrible accident. The singularity exploded, killing thousands instantly. But they were the lucky ones. Those who survived were left to a fate worse than death. The E-99 radiation mutated every living thing on the island, including humans. The island was quarantined and abandoned. But not before E-99 had been effectively mass-produced and implemented in everything from microwaves and vehicles to weapons more powerful than America's atomic bomb. On the heels of this success, Demichev was able to quickly rise through the party ranks, preaching all the while that Russia had a technological advantage it must use quickly and ruthlessly. And Premier Khrushchev agreed. Russia launched a preemptive strike against the United States, devastating its entire East Coast with a single E-99 bomb. Simultaneous attacks were also launched across Europe. Germany, France, Great Britain. None could stand against the E-99 weapons of the USSR's troops. Within <laughs> six months, the entire world was under Khrushchev's control. But not for long. Demichev used his growing number of supporters to oust Khrushchev and install himself as Chancellor for life. Hmm. God damn. So you see, the timeline has been altered, but it can be corrected. The singularity is the key. With it, Demichev rose to power. The Soviet Union dominated the world. If you destroy the singularity in the past, History will correct itself. But the only thing that can destroy the singularity is something of equal power. The E-99 bomb Khrushchev desired. There's one aboard a freighter that sunk in the harbor when the singularity yeah. exploded. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. Take that elevator down into the old rail line. From there, you'll have to travel to the docks. Catherine and I will do our best to help you. What are you guys going to do from here? Play... My Jenga? What's upstairs? First of all, personal entry one. I had to lock my tower after the incident. The people were massing at the lower elevator and looks like their faces were not that of friends. <sighs> Sometimes gain double for a single tight drop. Ooh, I really want that. My daughter, she never. Huh. I'm in the tower with my rations fading away. Ever so often, I, lo I lone, I alone phase tick comes up from below, possibly looking for nest sites. You must cook them in boiling water in a small dish dash of my homemade anti radiation, which consists of garlic, or oregano, and a herb only no grown here on Cortega. With some sides radiation, it tastes not bad either. Version for the man, man from the future. I have set up special stations around the island to aid. Gifted. You should take the elevator to the old 
Okay. Yeah, as if we're not going to completely destroy all time and space by uh, doing this. Where's the elevator? Here. Wait, isn't this the elevator we just came in on? Can I get a save? Save. Hell yeah. What's this one do? Teleport? Deadlock, okay. First mass one to launch it. a deadlock creates a sphere of chrono that slows time. I'd like to have a save, that'd be nice. Ugh. This place is gross. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I landed on a tick. God damn. Where the fuck are those things coming from? They're just swarming me. Okay, I did check point me here, so I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed these videos, feel free to hit the thumbs up button on them. If you don't like, want to hit the thumbs up button because you don't want people to know who I'm, that you're watching me. Go ahead and put a thumbs up emoji or something like that. Interact with the video somehow. That way YouTube's algorithms know, know that these are getting love. That being said, though, thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Hey, and peace out.